What's going on guys? This is XJD and today we're gonna to show do some bonus episodes for Pokemon Sapphire version. Alright, since the last time I beat this game, I haven't done anything. So we're here in our room with um all my OP starter Pokemon. We got the whole team here with Swampert at level 55, everybody else at level 53. Let's check out our moves after they changed it all. So Swampert, he uh he still doesn't know Endivore. I didn't bother teaching him it. That's my last play. Uh, he has the soft sand on. Pretty doing good. He's uh, I don't really care about these. But yeah, Swampert, my starter Pokemon, doing pretty rock at low 55. Next up, we got my boy Machoke. Got the low kick submission, cross chop, and strength. He was a great asset to our team when we were playing this game. And Nine Tails was just a badass. She was just going ham all the time, just doing mad. Stats, effects with that track confusion, and roll was combo, plus flamethrower as a st attack. My legendary Pokemon has Kyogre, Thunder, Calm Mind, has Blizzard, and Hydro Pump. Very good moveset for him. All around badass. Kyogre is always my favorite uh, legendary Pokemon. And Swallow, since the very beginning, she's been helping us out. We've got the Air Release, Quick Attack, End of Order Fly. Perfect moveset. I love it. And then we got Raichu. We got Thunderbolt, Thunder Wave, Quick Attack, and Thunder. Raichu came a long way since being a weak old Pikachu. I swear to God, he did. Alright. They're gone. Alright, so first thing I decided to do in our uh, bonus episode, I noticed that we didn't do the Shoal Cave area in this game. And it's my fault. It was totally my fault. I uh, didn't actually bother with it because it's not part of the story whatsoever. No one actually mentions it at all. Maybe somebody in Mosty does, but no one at all mentions it. So we're going to go check it out and um, hopefully... Maybe have a good time, I guess. I don't know. Whoa, Dad, what are you doing here? Hmm? Hey, it's XJD. It's been a while since I saw you, but you look stronger somehow. That's the impression I get, but your old man hasn't given up yet. Oh, yes, I have something for you. This came to you from someone named Mr. Brinny. What? The SS ticket. Wow. Okay. Hmm, a ticket for a fairy. If I recall, there are fairy ports in Sleepport and Lily Club. XJD, if you have ambition as a trainer, go to the Battle Tower. We should teach you that there is no end to a trainer's chosen path. I better get back to Pelver Gym. Mom, thanks for looking after the house while I'm away. Why are you calling Mom? Okay. Anyways. Alright, Mom, how are you doing, Mom? That dad of yours, he comes home for the first time in a while, but all he talks about is Pokemon. He needs to relax and stay a little longer. Wow, that's depressing, I guess. We bring you a special news bulletin. We've received reports of a red flying Pokemon in various home locales. The identity of the Pokemon has not yet been determined. We now return to you your regular, your regular movie presentation. The red Pokemon, that must be Latias. I don't like Latias as much as I don't care about Latios. So if I find Latias in my adventures, I'm going to kill it. Alright, but let's fly to Moss Deep City instead of walking the whole way. So I can withdraw my HM slave so she can surf. But she's not a bad slave. Remember guys, she this this in this uh, file, this is a whole new file from the first half of my let's play pretty much. This HM slave was really good to me. She picked up a lot of rare candies I distributed at, at the end of the game before firing champion Steven. So hopefully uh cast one. HS she has revived. She has revived. That's gonna be good for us. Alright, so who should I leave? I'll take out Swellow because they're not gonna be flying anywhere exactly. And it's not like this next area is gonna be necessarily uh, difficult or anything. This is gonna be a little exploration test. Gonna explore a bit. Alright, so why don't we get right into it? I love this song. I love this game. Okay, rocks. Whoa, what is this house? Hunter's house. Who's Hunter? This me, Hunter. That's a cool name, Hunter. Hey, Hunter, how you doing? I'm the diving treasure hunter. Oh, so you're uh, just a uh, treasure hunter. I'm the awesome dude who makes deep sea dives to gather treasures resting at the bottom. You haven't got any treasures for me. If you see any shards like the red shard, you've got to trade it with me. Okay, maybe one day. Maybe one day. Maybe one day we'll do that, sir. Anyways, let's go. We're going to continue 
and uh, find Soul Cave and get that off our checklist of stuff I have to do before I, and I didn't attach a repel. Level 33 Tentacool. Tenta, Tenta, you're so cool. No one can do it. Great. Anyways, let's equip. Max Repel, I'm pretty sure there's gonna be wild Pokemon in this dungeon are coming up, but I kinda wanna record them all. Oh my god! Oh my god. I don't even have dive anymore, so I can't even dive on the bottom of the sea because I. Oh god. That was close. Oh, come on. Dang, where's the trophy at? <gasps> this item. Anyways, I don't have di dive anymore as an HM because I made my swapper forget that so he can actually learn other moves. Oh my god, right? Like, go. What? I mean, look. Dude, how do I get to Soul Cave? I just swam across the freaking ocean, dude. Okay, um, there's obviously something over there because I saw an item and I want the item. Don't know how to get it. Okay, this is gonna be a problem, sis. Maybe I have to go around Mossy City the other direction I came from. Hmm. Let's go this way, guys. HGD is not great at traveling by sea. I don't know my difference between starboard and uh, port bow. Anyways, let's turn this down a bit in case this is blessing you guys' ears off so you guys can hear me. We're gonna go around this way and hopefully show cave this way. That's Moss Deep City. Here we go, here we go. Okay, okay. Oh, wait, that's a... <gasps> is that a trainer? Let's find a trainer. He turned around fast. Ahoy, I'm a buff, tough sailor. I bathe the world seas. Rock on, bro. Alright, let's uh, test out our Pokemon strength. Let's see how we've been doing. Wow, oh, level 33. My Swamber will wreck you. It's not very effective. But it'll still want to KO. Tentacle, switch up. Now, my Machoke has had the Macho Brace equipped for like the whole game. So it's only natural that Tentacle would attack first because his speed was decreased in exchange for extra attack. Him being fighting type, all physical attack and uh, stab or whatever. Anyways. Oh, you have Machoke. Now we got Throw Down, bro. We got Bro Down. Let's go. Let's go, bro. Alright, uh, I gotta trip you. You're dead. Alright, we did it. That was pretty easy. I kind of wish the trainers would get stronger at, after the game. Like, all the Pokemon that are still, like, first evolved, evolution would, like, evolve to the next stage. I don't know. It's like the trainers that Oh, ooh, a double battle. Who am I going to go with? Yo, Nine Tails and Raichu, though. Okay, alright. Let's switch around. Alright. Hey, girls. Kim, can you tell me what we're looking out for out here? Kim, what are you looking for out here? Senior and Junior, Kim and Iris would like to battle. Kim and Iris sent out Swablu and Numel. Both level 34 through 36. Alright guys, we're gonna set up and paralyze them. Only so, is Numel ground type? Numel's ground type, ain't he? Well, we're gonna paralyze her. We're gonna attract you. We're gonna make sure they can't even damage us when we're done with them. Oh, oblivious! It prevents, prevents romance. Wow, that was, yo, that's a good effect. I swear to God. That's why in the Johto region, in Slowpoke, well, you gotta get Slowpoke to take out Whitney. Because oblivious will not affect. Alright, um, let's see. We're gonna go ahead and Thunderbolt. Thunderbolt. So I can't do my triple strategy deluxe attack on him. But we'll just confuse Ray Hand because I'm pretty sure Oblivious doesn't block confusion if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> Phone Numa was abused. Oh, that seemed to damage to me, bastards. Alright, let's kill him. Let's kill it! 
Oh my god, he does doesn't take damage from thunder attacks, dude. Okay. Good job, Nine Tails. Big sis had to show the little bro how this how it's done. Oh, we can't sort of close. No, you didn't. Yeah, I, I have like six other Pokemon that are much stronger than these two. What are you guys looking for? A funny old man lives in the show cave, doesn't he? Let's go see him, Iris. Funny old man? Guys, let's look for a funny old man. What's the item I missed? I don't care. Where's the funny old man? Oh, I kind of mad this stage has the same generic cave song. Could have something special. <gasps> funny old man! That was easy. Are you planning on going deep in there? How about bringing me some shell salt and shell shells? I can make something good if you bring me the ingredients. Oh yeah, bro, let's do it. Wow, oh wow, this is a uh, interesting. Wow, what the heck? Dude, I can't even go out there. What is this stage's problem? This is gonna be a cool stage, ain't it? I don't really remember coming here often. As a child, in the days of old, first playing this game. Well, wow, this is gonna be a maze. This is gonna be sick. I wonder what that is, I want it. Item. Note the item, guys. Note that for me before I miss it. Wow, this is gonna be awesome. Wow, this is like freaking Victory Road. This stage better get sick. Oh, cool. What, what, what is this? What is this? Soul Salt. Awesome. It even shrank a little bit to show that you picked up Soul Salt. Alright, we got Ice Heal. I'm, I'm pretty sure we'll be facing some Ice type foe. Uh oh, here we go. And the first encounter is. Wow, Golbat, bro. How generic for caves. What are out there? Uh, just, just leave me alone, bro. We won't have any problems. Alright, let's uh, go. Go. Oh, man, this is gonna be a badass stage. All right, let's see who else is on. Who else is next? Naruto, battle on the bridge. <gasps> Spiel! Spiel! I like Spiel. Spiel's a cute Pokemon. I don't really mind Celio or Walrein, but Spiel's a cute Pokemon. And I'll, I'll be sure not to Thunderbolt you. I'll just leave you alone because you're cute. And you don't, you don't mean much. You don't harm. You, you're not trying to harm anybody. You're just chilling in your cave habitat, dude. Like, I, I feel you. I feel you. Zubats, on the other hand, I could kill every day because Zubats are the trolls of Pokemon. Other than trainers that make their Graveler use self destruct. This is the same spiel, isn't it? Uh, I, I don't know. I feel like the levels are like so spread out. You'd have to like catch this field and catch another one because it, the second one was like 10 levels higher than the one just cost. This level's weird. See, that one was 26 and the last one was 32. If I got that one just now, I would have been pissed. Anyways. I think the stage comes, or I don't know. It doesn't come too late in the game to be, like, to be mentioned. It, yeah, it just isn't mentioned throughout the game. Like, you just don't, you, like, I don't know. You have to explore in order to find this game. And, in order to find this game. And I like that, that you have to explore. It's just that... It's easy to miss, so someone will probably never do it, or this will probably be the first time someone, someone watches me do it. And I'm not saying that's likely, it's just that the thing about Pokemon games is that the at the story is usually really weak. <gasps> a trainer. Oh. Oh, man. Alright, I'm gonna slap on a repel. This is wasting my time. Why didn't I do that earlier? I should do this wrong with you. Wasting my time. Alright, let's uh, slap on the repel. No, not the Pokemon Navigator. The... No, what the heck? Why did I go down even farther? That's a repel. Alright, 250 steps. We're good. What are you doing, your sirs? The penetrating cold around these parts is an impediment to training, but with focus, one can overcome. With this focus band, buckle down and withstand the cold. <gasps> Thank you. Where does this lead? Wow. Dude, this is gonna be a whining ass dungeon, huh? Alright, let's pick this up because I don't want to jump off the ledge because I want to see what's in that other cave entrance. <gasps> Strength. Good thing I have on my chokes, though. I, I don't think I've ever been this far in this dungeon, honestly speaking. Like, I said that about the. the... Oh, snap. Oh, yeah, I definitely haven't been here ever. Wow, this is sick. How come I've never been here? 
probably because every time I try oh wait this is ice mechanic puzzles I can't do this actually proved proved I couldn't do this in like the, the, the ice type gym in those water I can't do ice mechanics I suck at ice mechanics all right here we go guys I can do this I, I can do this I'm gonna do it damn it I can do it okay oh I see where I gotta go patch patch okay let's go Careful, just careful, careful. Okay, here we go. We're good. Shut up, Zubass. God damn it. All right, we're good. Hey, we did it. Um, hmm. I know what to do. Here we go. Dude, I ain't never been in this part of the dungeon. This is kind of sick. I was, I was like, dude, this is like the coolest thing ever. <gasps> never melt ice. That increases the power of your ice type attacks, which means it is encouraging me to catch a spiel, which I might do. In my let's play of Pokemon Alpha Sapphire, that is, I'm totally gonna let's play that game as soon as it comes out. I don't care if I, if I did Pokemon Sapphire six months earlier, I'll do that game again because it looks sick. Anyways, before we get all fanboy hypey, we're gonna wait a minute. Oh my god, ice mechanics, dude. Ice mechanics. Okay, I know what to do. Here we go. Zubat, I swear to god, I'll punch you in the face. Um, wait a minute. Oh, here we go. Hey, hey, no, wait, what the? Oh my gosh, I must have been the wrong way. Okay, alright, here we go. Okay, here we go. Yo, ice mechanics are so small. <gasps> KM07? What is that? Is that Blizzard or Ice Beam? I don't know, it could be either or. It could be Ice Shard, if anything, but I think that's a Gen 4 move, so I wouldn't get my host up on that attack. Hail! Not that I care. Alright, so we got all the items out here. That was cool. Dude, why isn't like Reggie Ice in this cave? That's why I don't like the Reggie Pokemon. Like, it's like they're in these complicated areas that include Braille. And like, dude, how are you gonna be blind and play this game and you can't do it anyways because you're blind? Anywho, this is a cool dungeon and the time's gonna run on a little bit because all my videos are gonna be tw or 20 minutes for some reason. And, um, Show Salt, awesome. But yeah, I'll definitely continue or go as far as I possibly can because I don't know how when this dungeon ends. This is a cool. Oh my. Ooh. Anywho, let's continue and hopefully have a good time with this thing. Um. Wow. Wait a minute. I guess that's it. Oh. Is that it? Oh, I see what's going on here. Okay. Alright, guys, we're gonna... Let's see what else we can do here. Because, if I'm not mistaken, this area is controlled by high and low tides. And I don't know how to control that, or the time it happens. Because this game's inner clock is messed up, I guess. Well, not my game. Not, not this inner clock. But, I don't know, it's hard to understand. It's, it's like one of those weird things. But I gotta come back here, hopefully when the tide is high. That way, I can get the soul shells, because they got all the soul salts. This is a fun dungeon. This was an awesome dungeon, guys. And I'm glad I could share it with you guys. But, uh, yeah, I guess the video's gonna end in a bit. Um, let's have a Pokemon fight right before the end of the day. Well, Zubat appeared. And I'm gonna overkill you. Take this. Alright guys, my name is XJD. Like, comment, subscribe to my channel. And check out my social media, Facebook and Twitter and all that. And I'll see you guys next time.